A Mississippi college student is dead and her boyfriend, after a history of violent abuse, has been arrested for her murder. 22-year-old Lauren Johansson is from Gulfport. She was living with her sister at Southern Miss in Hattiesburg, studying to be a nurse. Her father reported her missing July 2nd, a day after her sister awoke to find Lauren gone, her front door open, and her security camera smashed. The next day, police found her body in the trunk of her car near a cemetery in Harrison County and saw her boyfriend, 23-year-old Bryson Rivers, run into the woods. They arrested him using drones, police canines, and officers posing as a friend of Rivers. So uh, undercover officers were able to, um, through text messages, um, um, have uh, Rivers um, believe that he was corresponding with a friend um, and we were able to lure him out of the woods. In December, Rivers was arrested in Nashville while on vacation with Johansson. Police say they were parked in a rental car with a gun covered in blood and Johansson was severely beaten. Johansson's father begged the court not to release Rivers on bond. Once Rivers bonded out, there were multiple lapses with the court ordered GPS monitor that allowed him to return to Mississippi, despite being ordered not to leave Nashville by the judge. Rivers is now being held on a $1 million bond. There are resources out there for people experiencing domestic violence. The national hotline is 1-800-799-SAFE. The Gulf Coast Center for Domestic Violence is based in Biloxi, and they have a 24-hour crisis line at 1-800-800-1396. The New Orleans Family Justice Center also has a crisis hotline. That number is 504-592-4005.